So this is my video production cart. I picked this cart in particular because it is able to collapse and break down and be stored very easily. Unlike a lot of video production carts that are made out of metal, which is perfect. I actually still want one of those uh, behemoths simply because of its modularity and the ability to just magnetize things onto it. Um, but this one works because the caster wheels are great. It's light and it has three layers and each layer I'm able to put pretty much anything that I want. With this card, I really wanted to have the ability to put my Rodecaster Pro 2 and my A10 Mini and a laptop and a camera and have everything running without plugging into the wall. Now, the only way I was able to achieve this is by using this Anchor battery bank. Now, this Anchor battery bank is a 87 watt battery bank. And the thing that makes it so special compared to any other is the fact that it is able to output 15 volts of power. Now, the reason why 15 is special is because the Rodecaster Pro requires 12 volts out uh, to be able to power on. So with this Anchor battery bank, I'm able to power my Rodecaster Pro, A10 Mini, a camera, and a MacBook. Not quite. For about two and a half hours. Two hours and 28 minutes. And that, to me, that's plenty enough time to create content. All right, let's talk about how everything comes together. Let's start with the back side, also known as the business side. Let's start off with this Wally laptop desk mount tray. It mounts to the cart and it has a tray that holds laptops, iPads, or whatever. I got it off Amazon and it was pretty affordable. All right, let's continue with this UT-Bit camera arm. This was also on Amazon and it holds up to four pounds. It holds my Sony a7C and my a7 IV comfortably, and I grip it onto the Wally mount. All right, so let's talk about the Manfrotto clip. I attach a blue compass arm to my Manfrotto clip, and you fasten it, and then you clamp the clamp down to the cart, and it's not going to go anywhere. Uh, super snug, just like the Wally desktop mount. I love this cart because this was an idea that I had for a while now, and I'm able to just bring it into existence. And I love it because I can also just move it around anywhere I want to. I can just change the orientation of a shot right away without obstructing a whole entire set. Like I'm able to just move the camera here and not have to worry about uh, moving or unplug anything because everything that is plugged in is in the cart, the battery, the Rodecaster Pro, the microphone, the XLR cables, everything. One other thing I love about this whole setup is that I'm able to uh, work in conjunction with other creators and not get in their way. One last thing about this video cart. I was shooting a talking head video for a lawyer and I was in her office and she had a bunch of stuff all over her desk, like pictures, awards, all these other cool stuff. And I knocked over a picture that was on her desk with a C stand picture fell and I picked it up and she was like, Hey, th is it okay? And the picture was fine, but the frame was cracked. And so was the glass on the frame was cracked. And it was an old image of her and her late father. It, I was like, Hey, listen, I'm, I'm willing to pay for the frame. She was like, no, it's fine. It's fine. I'll get a replacement. And I think we shot, a year or two later and I was doing another talking head video for her law firm and I just peeked into her office just trying to look into different ideas for the video and on her desk was that same shattered photo. It's like now there's a permanent stain in our relationship, business relationship, yet accidents happen. But what is a way for me to not allow that to happen again? That's the story for the video car and why it exists. And I promise to never ever have any picture frames fall over again. All right, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please let me know if you have any suggestions on things I can add or remove. Um, let me know your overall thoughts about it, please, in the comments down below. Thank you for watching. Have a nice one. Peace.